couples to use the bathroom with which they identify. It's a conversation that continues to dominate the national stage. States like North Carolina and legislatures like the one in South Dakota who are opposed to allowing trans men and women to use restrooms they feel comfortable with may bring up the topic of bathrooms and locker rooms in schools. Valley News Team's Cornelius Hawker reached out to local school districts here in the Valley for their stance on the issue. Cornelius? Andrea, like you said, I reached out to school districts on the North Dakota side of our viewing area from Cavalier County down to Sargent County. And here are some of the responses I received regarding school district stances on allowing trans students to use the bathroom with which they most feel comfortable. Jamestown Public School District Superintendent said their school board recently brought up the topic as an area for future policy study, and they have not had any student, family, or community requests in their area. Barnes County North Superintendent said this is on their agenda for the next school board policy committee meeting, and they're hoping to have a policy in place before there's a problem. And finally, Kinzel Public School Superintendent said he hopes his board will adopt a policy where students can only use the bathroom based on their sex at birth. We'll have responses from Minnesota schools on this issue for you on Valley News Live at 5 and 6 tomorrow. Andrea? All right, thank you, Cornelius. Responses from other North Dakota schools can be found on our website, valleynewslive.com. Simply look for this story. After 